Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're a first time watcher, glad to have you here. If you're a returning favorite, welcome on back. So today I have a um, preview video of five, five, um, Grim Canner Reserve fragrances that are launching this Thursday, July 27th. I believe the time is 9 a.m. Eastern. If that changes, um, I'll put it in the description below. Also check my Instagram. There's a button up there for it somewhere. Uh, so there's five fragrances coming out. And on Thursday, uh, you can save 15% by using code Philly Candleman. So Kringle was kind of sending me two of the five. I have the other five, uh, the other three uh, scent notes here and pictures. So let me show you what I have first, and then we'll go in uh, to the other ones, and then we'll we'll come back to these. So this is pineapple cilantro, pineapple cilantro right there. All right, same uh, translucent black glass as before this one we're going to talk about a lot because i think it's going to probably be the one that's going to sell out first uh and that is of course fresh baked bread now this is not a new fragrance it has been out in the past from kringle um i have the old version here with me uh we'll go we'll go through that there all right so the other three, it's a little close there, Phoenix. So uh, Phoenix, I think they're starting to post these. By the time I post this video in the morning, this is today's Monday, I think they're going to have all the photos on their Instagram by then. But so Phoenix, um, it's like like a Phoenix, right? It's purple and blue, uh, looks very nice. Uh, it reads, a juicy blend of sweet French apricot, peach, and pink apple, Intertwines with jasmine leaf and sugared caramel woods. This one has top notes of raspberry blossoms, sweet peach, pink apple, and mid notes of French apricot, coconut milk, jasmine leaf, um, and then the base notes of sugared musk and caramel woods. So that is Phoenix. Next we have here is Sweet Geometry. Um, the label is a chalkboard. There is a ice cream cone with some gelato in it um, and some other pieces of food <laughs> on here drawing something in chalk. Um, so Sweet Geometry reads, a mouth-watering scent featuring notes of zesty lemon, apple peel, and cherry sorbet splashed with a touch of mint, almond extract, sweetened with a touch of vanilla sugar. Top notes of lemon twist, green mint, apple peel, mids of cherry sorbet, almond extract, jasmine petal, again, um, and then we have, this is very similar to Phoenix, hmm. uh, base of sugar cone, vanilla sugar, and sweet musk, okay, and then the last one here is Summer Wish, now, you guys remember, um, there's a Yankee Candle fragrance. It was a green jar, um, and it was called Summer Wish. And at in here or the UK it was called Summer Wish. Here or the UK it was called Children's Wish or Child's Wish, something like that. And it had the um, dandelion on it with the the petals and the seeds blowing from it. There, that's what this looks like. But it's just a, it's black, uh, black background with just the one dandelion going like that. Spreading its weeds to everyone. <laughs> uh, summer wish. Light summer breezes dance across fresh cut greens. Now this is what had me excited. And a garden of delicate flowers and herbs bringing you back to sweet carefree days of childhood innocence of making magical wishes in the backyard. Uh, so this has top notes of fresh air and mint sprig. Mid notes of chamomile, wild lilies, and ballerina lavender. That's just a fancy name for Spanish lavender. And then base is lemongrass, tonka bean, and summer musk. So this is definitely going to be, I, I know us in the candle world, in the candle community, uh, everybody out there, we're already burning fall, right? Um, Halloween fragrances, you know, we're, we're burning that stuff there, and we got some summer candles coming out here. Some people are not seasonal burners. Some people just will burn all year round. Some people are still burning um you know, fruity fragrances 
right? Fruity summery fragrances um, until September, mid-September, early October, when the fall, when it starts to actually get cool, especially here in the East Coast, when it starts to get cooler a little bit. Um, so yeah, there, there you have it there. Uh, so that's the three I don't have. Now let's go into the two that I do have here, and that is pineapple cilantro first. Okay. Uh, they are the white wax, two wick, soy wax, 100% soy wax here. Oh yeah, so, 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 this is definitely a summer, summer fragrance, no doubt about it. Pineapple, juicy pineapple. So, kind of different from the pineapple fragrance in the uh, last reserve launch. It's a little bit different. But it's just juicy and sweet. You can actually uh, feel, you know, smell the, the cilantro leaves in here. Mm. <clears throat> Not much of an effervescent, but definitely drinkable. I could totally drink this. This is weird, but I could drink it. So, very pineapple heavy and the cilantro zesty a little bit. Uh, coconut. Coconut in here. That's what makes it very um, summery as well. Coconut, pineapple, sweet. Cilantro. Let's see what Colonel has to say about this. Pineapple cilantro. Juicy uh, and pineapple and shaved coconut is combined with golden apple, crushed cilantro leaves, lemon zest, topped with caramelized Caram caramelized sugar and vanilla. Uh, top notes of juicy pineapple, lemon zest, airy cilantro leaf. Mid is shaved coconut, water lily, golden golden apple, and the base notes of vanilla extract and caramelized sugar. <clears throat> this would be too strong for me to burn in the house because I don't do these fragrances. Um, Burning it outside on the patio, totally. In the house for me, especially if it's, it's decently strong on cold, you can smell it. Would be too much for me. Too much. Um, that's not a problem. But some folks enjoy that. So that's pineapple cilantro. All right. And last we have here, which I once again, I think is going to be the most popular one, which is fresh baked bread here. So the version I have is exactly 10 years old. Uh, it's from 2013. So here is the evolution there. This is an old two wick. I love these jars, these little canister jars. So cute. Um, this is actually, I think this, it's not a sticker on here. It's, it's it predates, uh, this part is a sticker. So, oops, sorry. so this part's a sticker for sure, but this is actually printed on the jar. So, um, and we also have back in the old days, they used to put the label on the lid as well. This is partially burned, but still smells amazing after 10 years. Um, I picked this up at um, a thrift store a few months ago for two bucks. I don't know if the price is still on there. I think I took it off, but it was two bucks. Picked it up. Uh, 2013 pour, it's uh, 9.25 ounces. So, but it still smells great and it smells the same. It really does. Now, there might be slight variations, but for the most part, I, I with the age of this candle and this, I'm going to say they're the same. So you get that fresh baked hot um, bread right out of the oven here. Uh, very similar to um, the Bath and Body Works uh, French baguette, right? French baguette. If you liked French baguette, you'll love this for sure. But it just feels like I'm baking some fresh bread, which I've never done, but I've been in bakeries where they're baking the fresh bread. Yeah, it's um, it's really hard to pull out all the different notes of this, right? Like you're gonna get the flour and uh, a little bit of the yeast in here. Um, 
that to make the the ingredients to make the bread. But yeah, as far as like execution, this smells like a fresh baked fresh baked bread for sure. Uh, not like sweet and savory at all. Um, that was a completely different scent profile. Um, this one, exact same in my mind, my opinion, as the old fresh baked bread and very similar to French baguette. So uh, what does Kringle say about it? Notes of fresh buttery baguette. <laughs> Fresh buttery baguette are wrapped with creamy milk and toasted wheat to bring you savory and fluffy French bread. There you go. Top bakery flour, creamy milk, made of buttery baguette, toasted wheat, base of fluffy musk, and savory accord. There you have it. So again, these are launching Thursday, July 27th. As of right now, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, you can save 15% with code Philly Candleman. Put that in, I, I will put that in the description down below. Um, and yes, if you've been watching the whole time, I do know there is a witch's cauldron behind me. Um, so stay tuned. All right, guys, uh, I'll see y'all real soon. Stay safe out there.